The Expendables 3 is about to hit the box office this weekend with an all-star lineup, big names, and ABC's Cameron Matheson sitting down with all of them. It's the blockbuster summer action movie chalk full of stars. And for Stallone and his posse, the third time is most certainly the charm. Why will people want to go and see Expendables 3? I think it has a little bit of everything. It, it you know, it's a throwback, but then again, it's modern because you have the young Expendables. Couldn't take the stairs. Now you are representing the young guns here. What was it like being thrown into this Mount Rushmore of action movies. He was completely underwhelmed. Yeah, yeah they, didn't, like, oh, yeah. <laughs> no, they didn't care about us young guns. They just threw us in. They called us different names. So I would call me Rhonda all the time. But you know, it was. Uh, <laughs> what did you learn from these guys? Nothing. <laughs> Not a thing. Uh, siestas, That's taking naps at, at, at noon. Kelsey, in, in some ways, you're also sort of the odd man out a little bit. What was it like for you being thrown um, into the mix? An absolute joy. Absolute pleasure. I'm, work, I'm working mostly with Sly, of course. Yes. And, uh, you know, like you said, the script is a blueprint. We'd sit down and say, you know, I'd say, I think this line's not so good. And he'd say, yeah, I always thought that. Would was you say it like that to you? Yeah. But, but then he'd say, yeah, that's from an old draft. And I'd say, okay, good, okay, good. So let's try How'd that get in there? <laughs> we were close once. We started this whole expendables thing together, but we had a falling out. I mean, you play the obvious villain in this movie. I don't see him as a bad guy. I, th I saw all them as bad guys. Oh, I see. Uh, as Gibson answers, watch closely as our interview turns into a fast action sequence. And what was that? And an impromptu game of musical chairs. Stop the music. Hey, now. Okay. And I've lost weight, too. Yeah. Suddenly, I'm taller. <laughs> Who would win an arm wrestling competition if you guys were all going in? Who would come out? Ronda. 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 I'd love to hear from each of you. What advice would you each give a younger version of yourself going into the career? Like, what do you know now? that you really wish you knew that. Find out what you are good at and stick with it. And if you want to be a lead, I say be more of a person that does what comes naturally. Don't try to be a Shakespearean actor when you speak like me. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> I think it's more about the life lessons that you kind of accumulate over time. Yeah. And not so much about the career. I mean, the career is really kind of, it becomes secondary over time, mm. really. And it's about, it's about the more important stuff. I think, um, like the power of forgiveness, for example, in your life, you know, you need to do that. That you is need for to sure. Exercise that that is for sure. Man, I've had to forgive. Yeah. And that's great. Mm. And it, it sets you free. But I've had to be forgiven. And, uh, you know, you got to give and take the whole thing. That's uh, good advice. I can't help but make the segue, Kelsey. This, you know, I read and heard the words that you said to your, your sister's murderer recently mm. about, you know, coming up for parole. And I'm uh, just wondering. Uh, on the subject of forgiveness, how hard that was for you. Sorry to shift gears here a little bit. But yeah, I was just so thinking so about, um, uh, Chekhov wrote, um, since we are forgiven, it would be foolish if we did not forgive. Mm. My dad was shot, my sister was stabbed. Uh, I don't think you can outlaw guns or knives, but you can ask your, the states involved or whatever, or your penal code to, to make sure that those kind of people don't get out of jail again. I thought I'd close with one word from each of these brothers in acting. One word response of your experience working on this film. I'll say fantastic. Irreplaceable. Ecstasy. <laughs> Once in a lifetime. Expandable. <laughs> Uh, yeah, miserable. It's nothing like that. <laughs> what movie did you guys make? No, no. Can I change my word? I want to change my What's word. To what? Renegotiatable. Renegotiatable. <laughs> Terminable. <Yeah. laughs> Adorable. <It was>, yeah. <laughs> exactly. Great time with those guys. Our thanks to camera this morning. The Expendables 3 opens this Friday. This Friday.